there are things that I do on the lathe which involve the tool getting perilously close to either the collet or the chuck. Sometimes, in fact, within a, a few thou, depending on the part. At such times, it's a good idea to have a device, if one should lose concentration, to stop the tool slamming into the collet or chuck with disastrous consequences. I have to turn some tapped bosses, approximately five millimetres long, on the ends of what will be the steam chests for the 084. And to make sure that I don't go too far, I've set my little depth stop from the uh, steam chest I'm making to the appropriate point so that if I just gently turn up to the stop the length of this boss I'm trying to make will be approximately, approximately correct and then uh, when it's all about there I'll finalise it by measuring things properly but the depth stop just stops me from uh, making a fearful mistake and the way I control the carriage stop for position on the length on, on non-critical sort of parts years ago uh, and it started with the ML7 but it's been transferred to the Super 7 I've got a quarter of an inch diameter rod which is attached to the carriage using a pre-existing uh, pre-existing bolt hole which runs through a fairly substantial bracket attached to the rear end of the bed and having by whatever mechanism determined where that carriage needs to be to stop for the cut I simply use my little homemade screw stop which will then give or take a few thou stop the carriage where it needs to be so I don't have to keep reading dials and stuff this is a pre-existing I put in by Myford because the ML7 was the same this is a Super 7 quarter by 26 tapped hole into which with a spacer I screw in the end of the uh, stop rod. These holes are also quarter 26 and are part of the standard uh, Myford arrangement I think, I don't think I tapped those, I think they were already there for something or other um, and I've simply bolted two pieces of angle together to form the uh, support for the end of the of the of the, the rod that blocks the carriage when I can and uh, this face is machined square to that face to give a nice seating for the stop collar and obviously the carriage now can't move forward beyond the point that I've set that collar if you use this method of stopping uh, when using the carriage power feed when the leaf screws under power feed it's generally a good idea to stop the cut before the stop uh, gets fully home and just finish the end of the cut uh, gently I use the hand wheel of the carriage but uh, rather than have the, the stop slam into the um, to the end bracket I've used this method of carriage stop on the Myford lathes for nearly 40 years and actually have found it to be most useful so I hope this helps <laughs>